All right, hello, folks, and welcome back to MLB The Show 24. Last time we took on the Brewers, and we got destroyed 7-1. to And then, uh, I haven't played this in a while, but apparently the, the next game was tight, but I still lost it. Then I got blown out again. Today, hopefully the Angels will um, go easy on us, folks, because they are the Angels, so... And um, something I do want to do is um, I actually played this game twice because I wanted to get a warm-up game in. Um, how do I do this? Pitching rotation. I'm going to temporarily take Kikuchi out. And I'm going to put Lance McCullers in. Because, um... I, uh, Kikuchi got destroyed in the first inning. And then uh, McCullers... Looked a lot better, so, um, so I'm going to sit him down, and I want a lefty, and I want Kikuchi to come out of the pen if need be. So, here we are at Minute Maid Park. We're going to start with Lance today. See, his energy bar is a little bit higher than Kikuchi's. So you're starting with the colors today. And um, I'm going to switch him out. As I was saying, I was going to give Bregman a rest and put Desenzo in. Stupid uh, capture card going out again. So yeah. Pena, Alvarez, Tucker, Diaz, Singleton, Jake Myers is just garbage, but that's okay. We'll leave the lineup as is. No, Kyle Tucker is a good player, so screw you. So here we go. All right, hold a skip. I like the sound of that. Now here is Zach Neto. All right, Mr. Neto. Um, sounds like somebody from Wolverhampton Wanderers in, in the Premier League. They've had multiple people Houston. named Neto. I think their goalkeeper's name is Neto, I think. That's off the mark. Maybe I just need a new court or some crap, because this sucks. Uh, now stop the mid-pitch. Good thing he didn't have to hit the ball. My goodness, this sucks. That one fouled off two and two. Now McCullers doesn't actually have a fastball in his repertoire. McCullers winds fires. Knocks that one away, and we'll do it again. Let's get the slider outside. Hopefully he goes after it. I said slider outside, not down the middle of the plate. He was all over that one. Yes, he was. as it gets. Got his stride and load out of the way early. One at second. Not in time at first. Well, I got the lead runner. And next for LA, Luis Rangifo. Ball one low. Rangifo. I don't know what kind of name that is, but I'll take it. Last two pitches have been down in the zone. Pitcher clearly trying to get. Rudder takes off. Next offering is fouled back. I can't read the speed on his. Uh, Here's a 2 1. Right through there for a strike. Uh, anyway. 
On the ground to the left. To second, that's one. Throw to first, but he well, we got the lead runner twice now. now. The ball is coming out of the pitcher's hand. The way it comes out of his hand as an infielder. Wow, really impressive. Logan O'Hopper. There we go. Now, no balls in a strike. Starting to get real sick of this. 1-1 one, one now. Foul ball there. Uh, hopefully, those knuckle curve. Up the middle. They get the force, and that'll do it. All right, leadoff single, not too bad. It would work around that. My hitting's gotten so bad, I'm all the way down a veteran. That one way inside. In there. I had to take a fastball down the down the pipe because the OBS went out. I mean the capture card again. Oh, that's not a strike. Swing and a miss for the strikeout. Bohapi collects, fires the first, gets him. All right. Shouldn't have known that was coming. Swing and a miss as he was out front. Silson, he isn't really known as the starting pitcher that's going to get you deep into the start. It's not that he's not capable, he just hasn't proven that he can do it yet. He's got such great stuff. You just don't know from start to start whether it's a potential no hitter or it's a guy that's only going to give you three or four innings. And that'll fall for a base hit. Well, I'll take it. I was sitting on a higher level. That's an out, though. And at first, here's Jordan Alvarez. Hanging slider, though. I'll take it. The six best average in the AL. Swing and a ball hammered left field, and that one is gone. The home cooking of the Crawford boxes gives me a two to lead. One down, and next to hit for Houston, Kyle Tucker. And the first pitch misses for ball one. But for the most part, with that kind of stuff, you expect him to get to the middle of the ball game. Right side. Rolled over on a fastball down the middle. Is retired. Fastball groove right down the middle. Usually a lot of damage done with that pitch. A hard yeah, that's what I'm saying. To get that ball in the air, maybe yeah. drive it into the gap. Fought off foul. And what about analytics? Because one of the ways it seems like they've contributed to the trend is it's not just about are you capable of getting deep, that now focusing on the numbers, maybe the matchup is better with a different guy as the game goes on. And he deals. Got him looking, and he didn't like Yep, he got me on that one. Back here at Minute Maid Park. And now Nolan Shonwell. Nolan Shonwell. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Well, after putting up a nice inning on offense, got some runs across, this is where you look for the starter to go out there, have a shutdown inning. Don't give that other team any hope. Uh, you just hope that he can get through this inning, get the bats back up there while they're hot. The 1-1 one -one is fouled off. Uh, let's try the cutter. I don't know where I want it, though. And here it comes. Wherever it went, I stopped where I wanted it. <laughs> Let's go to the sinker now. Bows it off, still one and two. All right, slider down and in. That's down and in, a slider missed. Go back to the change up, throw it out, down. Let's see what happens. Got him! The string of the changeup. Nico Cavazos, the next to hit for the Angels. There's a swing and a drive. Well, that's gone. Curl, curl, curl. Nope. And out of here. It's his sixth home run of the season. It's 2 1. Joe Adele, batting with one down, takes a strike. Swing and a All right, I'll take that. One down, base is empty. Line drive takes it in for the out. Take it, Taylor folks. 
the next to hit for the Angels. That swing right there tells me he's seeing the ball pretty well. I know it didn't produce a hit, but he made solid contact, and that's all you're looking to do anytime you're at the plate. Two down, nobody on. Outside corner. I'll take it. Right. See if you go fishing. The wide to kick the pitch. One ball, two strikes. And that's off the inside edge. Two and two. Bounce to third. Desenzo. Over to first. Well, third out. still ahead after a leadoff solo shot. So I'll take it. And we're back. And now the DH, number 28. Silsa back to work. Fastball for a strike. On the ground, right side. Tosses to first. I could have made that play in and second. <laughs> Zach DeZenzo up next for the Astros. And there's a foul ball. One out, base is empty. Ground ball, left side. All right. Into the outfield. And DeZenzo's got some speed. Just one of those seeing eye base hits through the infield. Seeing eye single. A over on it a little bit, but sometimes those can find a hole and get you a knock. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Mauricio Dubon stands in now and watches strike one. Runner on the go. It's a pitch out. Caught the run down now, and they take well, him out. That's why I went on the second pitch. Maybe I'm too predictable. I always score the second pitch. That's off the mark. And a count two and one. Line drive. And that should be extra bases. Now he'll turn for second. Not stopping. He's going for three. The relay throw. Man, I stuck at the base pads. I'm too aggressive. I'm too aggressive. That cost me ball games, ball. you know, Out folks. The third inning. Here's Kevin Pilar. And the pitch. That one fouled off. Pilar measures six feet even, 200 pounds. He joined the team as a free agent. And that one is in the dirt. And the count is one and one. And the right hater deals. And another ball. Keeps the at back. Well, you hung the slider, I'll take it. And the righty deals. Ground ball right side. Altuve slings to first. One up, one down. Back to the top of the Angels lineup. Now at the plate, Zach Neto. First pitch doesn't find the zone. The Halos down by a run here in game one of this three game set. Up the middle. And it gets by him. Well, with the wrong direction originally. A couple of hits in a row for him here. Timing on the swing was good. Able to shoot the ball up the middle. Didn't square it up as much as he probably would have liked, but that's a good approach paying off. Here's Anthony Rendon up to the plate. Myers pulls that one down. Luis Renjifo gets a chance to hit here. He's 0 for 1. On the ground, right side. Altuve slings the first. And that is there you go. Back here in Houston, digging in. Jake Myers. The pitch. Swing Why did I swing at that? He got him to chase. And that's downstairs. There you go. Side. 
swings through that one. I was very late on that sucker. Fastballs. Look for him to slow it down right here ahead in the count. Next offering. Well, downstairs. didn't slow it down much. The pitch. Got him swinging. Oh, he's good on that slider. So the lineup flips over. Jose Altuve up to hit here. And that one is lifted in the air. Makes the grab, and there's two gone. And the batter will be Here goes Mr. Pena. Pena. Singleton scored his first time. Center field. Under it. And he makes the catch. Back here at Minute Maid Park. New inning getting started. And here's the catcher, Logan O'Hoppy. And there's a breaking ball that drops in there. Oh, one the count. Swings through that. I'll one. take that. Spoils the two strike pitch, and he'll see another. See if you'll chase this one well outside. Got him, no, instead, he'll take it on the corner. For the Angels, Nolan Shadowell. First pitch misses. Oh! Probably looks more focused at the plate and working the count after that first at bat strikeout. That pitch in for a strike. Now two and one. And a foul ball left side. Kicks and fires. The block. Base is empty one away. Top half of inning number four. Outside and that is ball four. So up next, Nico Cavadas. It's tough after falling behind a hitter, two balls and no strikes, but now at least he gets a fresh start against a new batter, but he needs to get back into the strike zone and start pitching with conviction. Desenzo cost the second. Oh, the first. oh, no! Good slider inside right there. Batter fighting to get there, just rolled over it, got the ground ball. Adele in the box with two gone, and it takes a look at a called strike. Next off. All right, I'll take that. Perhaps not quite ready to I wish I had the um, pitches by him for a couple of strikes. Now backs against the wall. He's going to have to figure something out and figure it out quickly. The Astros up by a run here in game one of this three game set. Headed down the line. Tucker really on his horse for it. Couldn't get to it before it dropped back. Not quite, but I tried. Good for it. Two outs. Breaking ball inside. Two and two. On the ground to third. Tosses the first. And that'll do it. There you go. Now look at bad through four. Bottom four. Or, or yeah, for at least uh, from the color's point of view anyway. Back to work. Alvarez. Bouncer to second. Oh. Renhifo on to first. Renhifo. The the That's the first time I've ever heard that name before. And there you go. Its way through for a hit. So a man aboard now with one away. Now I'm not going to steal with Tucker, folks. And now Gainer Diaz. Went down on strikes his first time through. Line drive, come on. Why well, hit that one? Good. The dugout after hitting the line drive that finds a glove, but she will get some high fives. You know, when you make great contact, you feel like you've done everything right. But in this game of baseball, not everything is in your control. In plenty of time to first, out with room to spare, and that. Yeah, I wanted to launch that one. I couldn't. And we're back. Now the left fielder, Taylor Ward. Here comes the pitch. 
That misses the zone, and that's ball one. You know, these Angels, simply put, are producing a lot of quality swings. They've hit seven line drives already, and even though some of them have been for outs, there's nothing wrong with delivering consistent hard contact. That's almost always going to lead to positive results. So digging in, Kevin Pillar. In the first pitch, misses. I don't know how Kevin Pillar is a um, nine hole hitter. Ball up Especially if you get hits like that. Base hit. And that turns the lineup over. He needed that one. It's been a tough stretch at the plate lately. Really nice job staying up the middle with his approach. He didn't try to do too much with the pitch, just shot it through the infield. Deal one. One and one. In the dirt, and the runner stays where he is. Man at first, one away. And yeah, that skips in the dirt. Sliced hard, but foul. With two well, it's not what I meant to do. Moving over there at first base, trying to stay out of the double play right here. Pilar on the move. Bounce to the left side. Rolls across He's the up. diamond. No chance at the double play with the runner in motion. Anthony Rendon making his way to the plate. Line to right, base hit. Pilar headed for the plate. The throw home. The tag, and he's safe. Uh, Comes through with the RBI. So Good job of driving that pitch the other way on a line. You know, hitters, they take so many reps in the cages working on going to the opposite field, and it doesn't always translate into the game, but right there it did, and he did it perfectly. Out there to center. Myers. All right. On the run. See what my bats can do here. Back here in Houston, bottom of the inning, and stepping in for the Astros, Zach Dezenzo. And a swing and a miss there. Well, you got to give him credit out there on the mound. This outing started off a little shaky, but he's found a way to settle in and turn this into a pretty good start. That shows you a lot about his. Memory. All right, I'm good. All right, I'm not going to run on the second pitch. Maybe I'll run on the third pitch. There's a lot of base hits up the middle, even on ground balls. So a nice job to use that big hole and get himself a hit. Here's Mauricio Dubon. Grounded to third, could be two. To second for one. Relay to first, double play. Maybe I should have ran on the first pitch. Crap. First pitch, and he just misses. And that one hammered. And no one can get there. Around first, heading for two. Around second now, going for three. The relay in there safe. Yep, I knew I had that one. Everything came together for him. Pitch was away, and he did exactly what you're supposed to do with the Okay, out two relay, let's get him home. Just go with the pitch. Here's the former MVP, Jose Altuve. Well, he got him home, all right. Fly ball down the left field line. It's a ball. Okay. He powers that one out of here. His seventh home run of the season. It's 4 2. Jeremy Pena digs in now. All right. On the ground. Rendon throw to first, and that's the third out. Altuve, Altuve delivers. Nice. Love it. And welcome back to the ballpark. All set for the top of the sixth. Now the batter now, Logan Ohapi. That one off the mark. The only reason why he's still in there is because I didn't get the bullpen going until late. Inning. Get that hot team back in there to swing the bats. That's a base hit. So a runner aboard to start the inning. Nolan Shonowell now at the plate. And there's the ball. Counts one and oh. Out front nice. swing, and that is strike one. one, ball, one strike. With the tying run at the plate, and we're the top half of the sixth. 
fair. But it's fair just inside the line. Runner around third. He scores, and it's a one-run game. And he gets there. The tie runs at third with a triple. Well, that may end up being... New pitcher on now, Ryan Presley. Still a lot now of game left, and down. this game could go either way. Number so 55. this is a big opportunity oh, yeah. for him. To no. Trip, and this one could be extra bases. The tying run is in to score from third. It's 4-4. The throw in. And he'll pull into third with an RBI triple. My goodness, there goes that lead. Gets it done in a big spot to get the run. Uh. Just a solid swing right there. Caught it out front and ripped. Out to short. Tosses across the first. I couldn't get him out of home. Number one, and a run comes in to score. Ward in the box now. No balls and a strike. Lifted in the air out to left. Alvarez pulls it in for the out. See, the thing with colors is I can't throw the high fastball because he doesn't have a high fastball to throw. Had a good eye there. Ooh. 35 years old, a former first round pick back in 2012. Take it. That's the third. And that is that. Oh, well. Back here in Houston, here's the left fielder, Jordan Alvarez. Silson back to work. And that one fouled off. You'll won. Tapped at the plate, but it's a foul ball. Righty delivers. That one just misses. Man, oh man, I don't know how you take that pitch. That's as close as it gets. Ripped on the ground a second. Throws the first in time. And that's one out as they get the leadoff hitter in the six. Well, I did go up to veteran plus after that home run. Last inning. So That's okay. With a one -out single. They go with one of their more experienced arms in this spot. Yeah, experienced, all right. Johnny Cueto. Right here, right-handed hitters have been having a lot of success against them so far this season. And here is Gaynor Diaz. Wouldn't chase that time. When you get ahead in the count, there's no doubt that the success rate goes up. And that's what he's been doing. It's made a big impact for him in recent games. Swung on, belted. In one hops off the wall, should be extra bases. Around third, the relay. And he's in safety. There you go. Got the run back, folks. Well, that was one of those high percentage advantage counts where batting Got McCullers off the hook. Higher. A chance now to take the lead, and at this point in the game, that could be a deciding run. And now here is number 28. Makes the grab on the run. Runner tagging from third. He'll score on the sack fly. And it's All right, that's how you do it. Take the lead right back. That misses off the outside edge. Foul back our way, and that's out of play. Instead of letting the hitter get his arms extended, tied him up a little bit, slightly up, slightly in. Shanowell, he takes it. All right, we'll take the, the lead back. Do it. Presley's on the bump for the win. Set for the start of the inning, and here is Zach Neto. Presley back to work. Flips the corner. That's strike one. Just missed. Next offering. Is there you go. Looking to get the tying run on base. 
Got him. And one gone. It's the first time I've thrown a sinker with Next him today. One for three. Strike one. Man. No saying for the down and out Job corner, and it goes inside. It actually was. That misses the zone. One and one. That one drifts inside. And downstairs. First pitch strike from the pitcher, but then no panic at all by the hitter. Very patient, showing good discipline. Now he's in the driver's seat with a 3-1 count. One down, base is empty. Good plate appearance there. Able to take the walk. Here's the second baseman, Luis Rangifo. And that's off the inside edge. And that's ball one. If you're a base runner, you've got to stay dialed in here. Look for anything in the dirt. Try your best to get into scoring position. That's a base hit. Just kind of slice that one into center. Well, that was an important at bat. This game, so a great job there stepping up to the challenge. I could watch base hits like that one all day long, and so could every hitting player in the league. Just a nice. How do you get that center field? This one in the dirt, but no advance from the runners. One out, the possible tying and go-ahead runs on base. Next offering upstairs. Good spot for the hitter. Definitely has the advantage in this count with runners on. Look for him to be aggressive on this next pitch. Ground ball could be two. Tags the runner for one, and that's two. Nice! 5-3 double play. You don't see that too often. For the last half of the inning. And stepping in for the Astros, Mauricio Dubon. Out to short. High throw to first, and he can't reach it. All right, thank you. Well, there's another extra base hit. Runner from second crosses the play. It's seven to five. Cut off, throw to third. Not in time. Two triples in back-to-back innings for Jake Myers. Absolutely smart. So the Angels turn to their bullpen for a new pitcher, Carson Fulmer. And compared to a lot of other relievers, strikeouts have not been a big weapon for him this year. So the defense. Line drive, and that should be extra bases. Runner from third comes across. It's eight to five, and that's a double. Better believe it. Didn't take long to get a result for that at bat. Nice line drive to full side, met it out front, but just stayed through it nice enough and ripped it into the outfield. That's towards center. Pilar brings it in, one down. Yeah, that was very shallow. So, man aboard. Now it's Jordan Alvarez. He's already homered in this game. Little chopper rolls foul. Good pitch. Altuve. Seeker Alvarez down. One down. Yeah, big Ooh. I didn't miss that by much, though. Two. Wouldn't chase that time. Excellent arm action on that two strike changeup. Just missed. Man, he wanted that call. Swing and a miss. Had him out front for the strike. Yes, he did. So next up, he gets the attention to walk here and now will force it any base with two gone. At the plate is the Astros catcher, Yaner Diaz. These fans don't like to see that because they showed up to watch him swing the bat, but this team does not want to let him beat him. Two on, two outs. Swing and a miss. And Another cool. hook. Another Uncle Charlie. He was trying to go deep right there, but you've got to get a pitch that you can handle. That one laced to center and a base hit. Fires it to the plate. 
It's off the mark and he scores. It's nine to five. There you go. The potential walk did not pay off there, pal. There aren't a whole lot of hits that are more satisfying than a nice line drive in the center field. So that definitely felt good. Two outs. A couple of base runners at first and second. Now a bullet. Oh, my God. I hit the crap out of that ball. And we're back. Ready to begin the eighth, and now the first baseman, Nolan Shonowell, and a pitch. And that you know what, I was going to bring in a Brayu, but I've got a good cushion now. Inside just missed. Might try to extend uh, Presley an extra inning. That one missed. Backdoor breaking ball just missed right there, and boy, umpire did give him the call. I bet you if he throws it again, hitter knows he's going to have to swing it. Left hand batter waits to the right side. Altuve slings to first. First out in the top of the eight. Next is the designated hitter, Nico Cavadas. Well, he didn't recognize changeup earlier enough. Got out in front a little bit, rolled over on it, and beat it into the ground. Swing and a high fly ball, pretty well struck right field. That's going back. Okay, with two high fastballs in a row, folks. Another homer, his second home run of the game, and they cut into the lead. It's nine six. Here's Joe Adele, right through there for a strike. Well, it's critical right here that they bear down and turn in some quality at bats. Try to chip away at that lead. Oh, and that deflects off his glove. He doesn't have a play, and they catch a break as they get a base runner at first. And next for L.A., Taylor Ward. In there for strike one. One run across in the frame so far, and we're in the top of the eighth. And takes low for ball one. Swing and a miss, and that's strike two. That one to first, and a base hit. Lead runner touches second, headed for third. Back-to-back -back singles. The Astros turn to a new arm on the mound, Brian Abreu. And if you dig into his walk rate, his numbers are really He's really filled up the strike zone this season, so these batters better be ready to swing the bats. Nope. Pilar up to bat next. Lays off for a ball. And another well, ball. So, and now see if Abreu can shut the door here. Ground ball to the nope. Side. And it's through for a hit. In to score from third. Nine seven now. Uh oh. Just a huge at bat right there. Just a simple ground ball the other way that had eyes on it, man. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Just let the ball travel, put the ball in play, and just hope it finds a hole. Breaking ball in there for a strike. Well, all eyes on the double play ball in this spot. No better way to get out of this inning. Falling behind two and one. So the tying run at second. This to third, and it finds its way through for a hit. Here's the throw to the plate. Save. He scores. Gosh darn it. Game. Anthony Rendon will hit next. On the ground, two ball. Fires to second for one. And that's All right. Whoo. Back now, new pitcher on the mound as we roll into the bottom of the eighth. Matt Moore. Just trying to keep this one close here, and this is where a bullpen can give their players a chance to fight back into the game. And first offering is fouled off. Kicks and deals. And a foul ball. And a pitch. That one in the dirt. Good take. And that is ball one. I was swung at that a good percentage of the time, but not this time. Wouldn't chase that time. At the belt and fires. 
Goes down, swinging uh, for the strikeout. Couldn't catch up to the heater. He was outside, too. Should have taken it. Dubon. In the air, right field. And there's two down. Jake Myers up next for the Astros. And a pop up right side, foul territory. He's got it, and that'll end the inning. All right, so. Back here in Houston. The second so Josh Hader gets the call to mount. These are the spots where Levers really make a name for themselves. Late and close. There's not much margin for error, but at the same time, there's a reason they're put in these situations. The pitch. On the ground right side. Altuve. Tosses the first. All right, there's one. At the play. Logan Ohapi. Couple of pitches and a quick out. This one chopped on the ground, but foul. A one-run lead here at the top of the ninth. Bounced, and that got the pitcher. Safe at first, and now after the Is play, okay? the lefty status. Up next for the Angels. Nolan Shonwell, the next to Nolan hit for the Angels. Shonwell. Pitch misses there. Ball one. They hope he's the guy to spark a comeback. He tends to play better when his team is behind, so why not him? Hit on the ground might be two. There's one. The double play. There we go. Hater gets the save. One. Nice double play to get him out of the jam. They get the W. Way to go, guys. And the final here today, 9-8. They hang on to win it by a run. For Chris Singleton, I hung on all right. Here at MLB the show. Thanks for stopping by. Home I'm cooking and Crawford Jones. boxes Talk there. And Altuve. That was a nice shot from Altuve there. So we got two more with the Angels. Oh. Okay, well, you got two more with the Angels, and then we get a day off, and we'll take on the Athletics in the uh, Coliseum next time on MLB The Show 24.